So hello and welcome to Toby's Tarot. Today I'm going to be looking at and reviewing the Avesbury Oracle by Melanie Jones. And this is a great Oracle deck. I recently went to the Avesbury Stones and I absolutely loved it. I love going to sacred sites. I went to Stonehenge. I've been to the Avesbury Stones. Um, and I've been to other stone circles around England and I really love going to sacred sites and being places of spirituality and lovely sites like that. So I really enjoyed going to Avesbury and seeing all the stones there and it was really beautiful and I really loved it there. And I saw this in a crystal shop just off the uh, in in the main, in the town of Avesbury. And I saw this on sale and I thought, yes, I've got to get it because it is, it's an, it's an Oracle deck from where I've been and somewhere that I enjoyed going to. So I thought I'd, I'd do it and I've used it in the messages from the universe in my videos uh, this month. And uh, they've got really good energy um, with them. And it, it's, it's very sacred and it's got a, like fairy energy and everything. And it's really beautiful. It comes in a lovely, lovely box like that it's nice and green all the way round and just a beautiful inside it comes with um, a few cards about how to do deck um, readings and what to do with them I've put them in a put a little paper clip on them because um, I don't want to get them in, um, in the main deck and there's a bit of information on there, 40 sacred stones and the angels that reside in them. So it's beautiful um, information there, 2020 deck, lovely. And these are cards do feature a lot of green, that's why when I was doing my, my tarot readings they didn't really show up because of my green screen. But they have beautiful cards, you can see here, like the trees and fairies or angels, whatever they're meant to be. Um, and nice uh, stock for the cards and it's just a lovely deck of and a souvenir as well of where I've been and there's lots of beautiful cards here so like nourished and held lovely artwork but we've lovely little messages on there as well let's turn them around so we can see I love this one the expect the unexpected with the beautiful red sky and things that are going to happen and move forward and then are all on the same way round, but this gives you a chance to uh, enjoy the um, the artwork. And there's lots of different artworks and different messages on them to show. You're guarded here, and there's lots of different cards. disappearing and the link very much with the with nature as well the stones and nature transform companions spend time with each other beautiful cards they do stick a bit sometimes that's a problem but clarity transition lovely artwork combined with lovely words on the cards and connecting to the stones as well um, beautiful energies um, I love the different colors used in these this deck uh, and all the different stones playful respect see I love the imagery as well like the angel and you get, you get a picture of the stone and then you get some some um, fairy or angel to work with and it's just beautiful beautiful cards here with gorgeous artwork and there's 40 cards for you to go through so there's a lot to go through and to help you with different readings as well to give different messages for different things which is always good and I like a deck that has lots of cards in it because I don't like a deck that's got like 10 cards in it because you can't shuffle but this is a really good deck because you can shuffle it really well and it does have lots of different cards with lots of beautiful um gorgeous um that's it, me casting shadow on it 
you know, there's lots of cards, beautiful artwork. I don't know what I can say about it, but it, it tunes into the ancient uh, magic that I feel like the ancient stones, the stones were there before. Um, and it tunes in like all the ancient magic and I love that and tuning into the ancients. So that's the Avesbury Oracle. Really beautiful deck uh, by uh, Melanie Jones and you can get it I suppose online. I'm not sure if it's uh, exclusive to Avesbury. It might be exclusive to Avesbury so you might have to go and visit it in summer or set and go and see it yourself. But yeah, beautiful stones. Absolutely love going there and uh, this is an amazing deck. So I hope you enjoy this little look and little review of the Avesbury Oracle by Melanie Jones. Blessed be.